the time of God's wrath is the seven year tribulation period all considered to be God's wrath I have heard that his wrath isn't until the last half which some feel leads credit to the mid tribulation theory exactly it's a theory which is a lie thank you for your wonderful sight I have a question is the seven year tribulation period all considered to be God's wrath I have heard that his wrath isn't until the last half which some feel leads credit to the mid tribulation theory they say to prepare for some very horrible times for us until the rapture takes place but if one considers the rapture as following the same pattern as the Jewish wedding ceremony, then you wouldn't have to think we would leave before or at the very beginning or the seven year period. Thank you for your thoughts on this. God's wrath begins in chapter 6. Revelation chapter 6. God's wrath begins in chapter 6 of the book of Revelation. It is specifically mentioned in chapter 6 verse 16 which announces that which the seal judgment of God's wrath has begun. <clears throat> in Revelation 15 1 the Bible says that the the Bible says that with the completion of the bull judgments, God's wrath will have an ended. This tells us that God's wrath has three components. The seal judgments of chapter 6, the trumpet judgments of chapter 8, and the bull judgments of chapter 16. Advisors of the so-called mid-trip portion incorrectly measure the great tribulation as a seven year period when in fact it's clearly described as being three and a half long Revelation 12 6 and 14 nevertheless the rapture will precede all of God's wrath 1st Thessalonians chapter 1 10 and 1st Thessalonians 5 9 this doesn't mean we'll miss out on all the rough times. However, in most parts of the world, the church is enduring great persecution. Even now, with over 3,000 Christians dying for their faith every day, I believe we're entering into a time where even the USA, the church, will endure much hardship. Thanks for watching and God bless.